Strange device. Looks broken. He is coming. Destroy it now. Centauri. Whatever this device is, Dagon killed other Jedi for it. Which planet next? Heading to the Shattered Moon. Next stop, Kobo's Moon. That's my line. Know your role. You shoot things. Me, I'm the pilot. So, you give that old tech Cal found in Dagon's place a look? Yeah. Maybe that lab on the moon will shed some light. What do you think happened to it? The moon? Ah, who knows? Who cares? I don't got time for moons. I think it had something to do with the invasion on Tantalor. How comforting. I'm surprised the moon's still habitable. You and me evidently have different ideas of habitable. I know. I've seen your cantina. Watch it. Arriving at our destination. Smidge rusty. You? A little restless, but we'll be fine. Oh, listen to you, Mr. Optimistic. Hmm. Hey, you want to do me a favor? Cut it out. You're giving me a stomach ache. Sure, it's not your cooking? <laughs> what was that? We're almost there. Locals say the moon's haunted. Okay? Me? Yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm just delighted you brought the manis to another haunted moon. It won't be long. Just gotta look for that laboratory Cordova found in the archive database. Sure. Take your time. They couldn't have put this laboratory in a sunnier place? No kidding. But if we find something here that'll help us navigate the Kobo Abyss, so be it. The way Grease tells it, the Abyss is a ship graveyard. And now we're on a lunar graveyard. A lot of graveyards. A lot of graveyards. Where's the laboratory? The laboratory is off limits. The laboratory is inaccessible. You're okay. Find somewhere to hide. I don't have access. I tried to tell them. Please, leave me be. The raiders really did a number on these droids. We should get these back to Cordova. I was promised surprise. <laughs> Your magic, BD. I'll run you! Lord, 
Think Cordova can make some sense of that tech hell found? Are you kidding me? That guy is as sharp as they come. I can't wait to see Sierra again. I owe her big time. She fronted me the credits for Pyloons. How much do you owe her, Grease? Two thousand credits, give or take. Maybe I'll make Granny Pyloons famous casserole and she'll forget all about it. For two thousand credits? That better be one hell of a casserole. How can we be sure it's safe? We cannot. The network's resources are stretched thin, and some local leaders are unwilling to accept the risks. How can we convince them? Many fear that accepting refugees will put a target on their back. Cal, you're back. Did you find anything? Think so. Good. Cordova will be glad to hear it. A strange device. This one seems to be a duplicate. Both have been damaged by lightsabers. Wasn't me, this time. Perish the thought. Hmm? You think you can fix it? I don't know, but I will certainly try. Master Junda, the Empire is nearing Pilgrim Sanctuary. Is it a strike force? No, an excavation team. Good, they don't know about the safe house. Yet. Safe house? Hidden in the ruins. Have we begun evacuations? They're already underway, but Brother Armaius isn't responding. Armaius has the communication codes. If they capture him, they could put the entire hidden path at risk. I know the ruins. I will go. I'm coming with you. Boat. You know what? I think I should stay here. Make myself useful. I could use a research assistant. Bring back Armaius. You got it. And no heroics. With this one? No promises. I think she was talking to you. What was this place? An old anchorite monastery. Impressive, isn't it? <laughs> Pilgrim Sanctuary is an ancient temple. Seer and Master Cordova chose it as the Hidden Path safe house. We knew one day the Empire would come. Just not so soon. Welcome back. Hey. The Imperial labor camp on Maza. The garrison's half empty. Can strike before reinforcements arrive. Sounds promising, but Marin and Grease haven't made it back to the ship yet. Well, as soon as they do, I'll scout ahead and they can rest on the Mantis. You know they'll never allow themselves to rest if you're in danger. You never give up. And that's what inspires all of us. But you have to remember that where you lead, they will follow. I know I've been pushing recently, but... Ever since Grease what got hurt. What happened to Grease is not your fault. But ever since then, you've been reckless. I keep worrying about something bad happening to one of you. It's good to acknowledge your fear. But don't let it determine your path. Focus on the moment. Choose your direction and act with certainty. And trust that, whatever the odds, you'll pull through. Cal, trust yourself. Trust in the Force. Exactly. Careful. I'll see you inside. Gotta hurry. Brother Armias can't hide forever. Ah. 
You know what to do. Sanctuary to all who seek it. Sounds too good to be true. Pilgrim Sanctuary should prove a worthy location for the safe house. Its proximity to the Archive is ideal. And with a bit of your slicing, this temple could once again provide safe haven for those who need it most. Janda sent me. Master Janda, you use the force, you're Cal Kestis. It's time to go. The Empire's closing in. Yes, which is why this must make it back to Master Janda. These contact codes cannot fall into the hands of the Empire.
Desert Ghost.
How did you do that? A ritual I learned when I returned to Dathomir. It is taxing. You okay? I am fine. Come on. Let's get these coats to see her. See her. They couldn't save Armaius. He gave his life for this. I'm sorry. I know you did your best, Cal. And the Empire? They did not track us. Hey, Scrapper. Glad you made it back in one piece. Master Kudova, did you find a way across the abyss? No. But you may have, Cal. Boat and I were able to find some interesting data in the archives. Let's show them what we dug up. Centuries ago, the Republic established the colony on Kobo to study a stellar anomaly known as the Abyss. Santari Kree led the research team. That Z with them. Early attempts to navigate the Abyss ended in disaster. The Republic was on the verge of abandoning the project. And then guess who volunteers to fly in alone and discovers a planet on the other side? Dagon. Using the data from his voyage, Kree invented the Abyss Compass to guide others safely to Tannelor. The Republic established a settlement, the Jedi built a temple, just like you said, Cal. Regrettably, a time of peace and prosperity was disrupted when Outer Rim Marauders invaded. I saw them too, but how'd they get across the Abyss? They must have stolen a compass. Don't worry, we won't be so careless. Overwhelmed, the Republic abandoned Tannelor, and the Jedi Council ordered Creed to destroy the compass. Dagangera refused and rebelled against the Order. That is a Gendai. They do not often ally with other species. Looks like Ravis has been working with Dagon for a lot longer than we thought. So the Order sent Jedi to secure the compasses. Dagon murders them over it. Jedi killing other Jedi. But Centauri said that Dagon was the key to Tantalor. Maybe he is young Jedi. Despite my efforts, those compasses you brought me were beyond repair. However, records indicate that three were unaccounted for. So you're saying one might still be out there? Yes, and Dagon sent his army to look for it. <laughs> I'd ask you to stay and help us, but I recognize that look. What look? Hope. That planet could be a haven for those who stand against the Empire. So you coming with us? I mean, Grease can make room on the Mantis. For all of you. No. This place needs me. The Hidden Path needs me. Cordova? I'm sorry, my friend. But for now, my place is on Jeddah with Seer. Let me prepare a data stick so you'll have access to our research wherever your journey takes you. Let me guess. You're staying too. When we first met, I thought that what we shared was... unique. Survivors. Fighting together against the Empire who took our families. Yeah. You helped me realize I wasn't alone. As did you. But there is a galaxy full of people who have suffered as we have. It's as Seer said. Perhaps you have found a sanctuary for them. Perhaps. If we can get to it. I will join you. Besides, it's been far too long since I've made Grease's hair stand on end. See you back on the Mantis night, sister. are on me! <laughs> uh, actually, uh, forget that last bit. The Mantis has changed. Oh yeah, Cal and Boat, they ain't exactly the cleaning types. I cleaned this morning. Wait, did I? No, I didn't. <laughs> That's on me. Marin, I didn't know you were coming. Hey, maybe I'll pick up some scar steaks. Why'd you join back up anyway? Seer and I believe Tanalor could be a refuge for those persecuted by the Empire. Persecuted by the Empire, huh? Gonna get crowded.
Welcome to Koba. Cal! Cal, so glad you're back! You missed all the action! It was horrible! Did something happen? The Raiders paid us another visit. Took a shine to that droid you found. See? They took her, Cal! Carried her right out! She's been droid-napped! My saloon better be okay, Turgle. I think you brought this down on us. I'm innocent, Mr. Grease! Promise! Dagon sent them. He's after Tantalor. There must be something more to Z than we realized. Something scrambled up in her memory banks. We have to rescue her. Once he gets what he wants, he'll scrap her for sure. It won't be easy to get her back. The raider base is in the swamp. They got it an old Luker Hulk battleship from the Clone Wars. We've seen it. Means they got a lot of firepower. As do we. She's right. Now's our time to move. I like where this is going. They already have what they came for. They're back at their fortress feeling safe, complacent. They'll never see it coming. Maybe not. But if you're wrong, then they'll be looking for payback. Not to worry. I will stay here and look after Grease and the others. You sure? I think you two can manage. Just don't let him swim without supervision. Let me know if you need help. My sex. Name's Mosey. Marin. All right. I'll scout ahead. Meet you there. 